asterisk and I don't know five different asterisks I'm not going to go through each one of these on their own I don't think or I'm not going to make a whole video about them uh, maybe you already know asterisks if you don't I'll say something about it there's a it's originally in French written by a, some Belgian people and it has been translated to English and uh, many other languages it's a series of comics about this small town or village that was not beaten, taken over by the Romans. The Romans took over the rest of Gaul, but they weren't able to get this one little village because this village has a magic potion that keeps them from, from taking over. Okay, that's the, that's the gist of them, and they have their own little adventures, and they have their own characters that are funny in their own ways. And if you're not going to ever like a comic like this, then you're never going to like a comic like this. But as you see, okay, so there's this little town uh, that is surrounded by the Romans, but they can't, the Romans can't take over. And they have all their own little quirks and, and characters that you get to know. Here's Julius Caesar. And, um, and these are, these are some of the characters in the book, that's Asterix and that's Obelix. And the thing is, it's absolutely packed with puns and other kinds of plays on words and, and jokey kinds of things. So let's see, this is Asterix. He basically is going off to the, you know, the fanciful sort of Middle East with the flying carpets. This is Asterix and the Papyrus, Caesar's, Caesar's Papyrus. This one is La Traviata, which is, uh, that's right, in this one there's a, there's there's someone who, who looks identical to someone who's in the village, and she goes in there to try to stir up some trouble. And uh, this one, oh, I haven't read this one for a while. They, there's a, yeah, a boat involved, I remember that, but I don't remember much else about it. And then the Transatlantic uh, Italique, the Trans Italique is this big race that goes across Italy that they're, that they're in, and they're, they're trying to win it. Um, you know, I'm trying, there is one, I think, I've, I think I'm missing one, because I kind of remember one about where they try to go find a, uh, a, not a sphinx, they try to go find some kind of animal or something. Anyway, they're originally written in French. My editions are in French. Uh, they're all cute. They're all fun. And I have heard that the French puns and, and jokes have been translated pretty well over to the English. Sometimes it's, it's impossible, really, to, to translate a play on words into a different language. Um, and, but, but sometimes you can, and a lot of the jokes are, are situational and probably can translate fairly well. So I haven't really read the English ones, not for a very long time, but, um, I do like the French ones and, uh, yeah, they're fun. Okay. So that's a bunch of asterisk books.